Hi, it's Dr. Barry. I want to talk to you today about the benefits of intermittent fasting. Now, you may have heard about this, you may not. It's definitely not mainstream, but I think it's moving that direction. Uh, intermittent fasting, as I describe on other videos on this channel, is a very natural, very ancient way of improving your health, of getting rid of excess fat, of uh, making your life and your health and your world a better place. Now, if you'd like to hear about these sorts of benefits and all the other health benefits of the things that I can share with you, please take a moment and share this on your social media. It helps me to help other people. I can only see so many people a day in the clinic, but with your help, I can, I can help many, many more people achieve their ideal health. Okay, so please share it on Facebook, on Twitter, Instagram, wherever you are social, please share this. Now, let's talk about the benefits of intermittent fasting. A lot of people, when they first hear the term intermittent fasting, they think about starvation. That's definitely not what it is. I've got videos that, that explain what it is and how to do it. But today, let's just focus on the benefits of doing it. And I'm going to be uh, the, getting these benefits that I'm going to tell you about from studies that have been done from my personal experience with intermittent fasting and also with uh, the experience of my many patients who ha are starting to implement intermittent fasting and make it part of their lifestyle and all the benefits that they've gained. Almost everyone does it, at least in part, for fat loss. And that's one of the biggest uh, benefits of intermittent fasting is that it keeps your insulin level low for more total hours a day, and that helps you lose fat. It helps your body remember, oh yeah, I can also burn fat. I don't have to just burn sugar for energy. Uh, it helps your body remember that your brain can also burn fat for fuel. It does not have to just burn glucose like many of us were taught in health class in high school. It can burn fat as well. And so as you be begin to implement intermittent fasting, you're going to burn fat. And that's good if you're trying to lose weight. The next thing is I've had more and more younger uh, male patients start to use intermittent fasting with their workouts and, it, and they say that, that they can tell it helps them with gains in the gym. There's research that shows that it, that it increases your human growth hormone, which is pretty much the hormone of the gym to help you gain muscle and, and be as youthful as possible. But I'm having multiple people, and I've even noticed that when I do get out on the farm and, and, and cut wood and, and work with the animals that I'm, I'm stronger and I'm more energetic when I'm fasting. So muscle growth and elevated HGH levels are definitely a byproduct of intermittent fasting. Another one is uh, improved immunity. I very, very seldom get sick because of my diet and, and, and my lifestyle, but more and more of my patients are saying, you know, I didn't get sick this, this fall or this winter, uh, and it's because of the intermittent fasting. It, it uh, optimizes your immune system and your immune response, and so you're just better able to either not get sick, or if you do get sick, it's a much more um, minor illness, and it goes away quicker. Another uh, thing that's being studied very, very aggressively in research in the medical literature is life extension. Every animal that uh, scientists have ever fasted in the lab lives longer, up to 30 to 50 percent longer. And so if you'd like to stay around for longer in a healthy fashion, intermittent fasting might just be for you. Um, another thing that I'm using it for that I'm having just an amazing success in the, in the clinic is to treat type 2 diabetes. Type 2 diabetics, when they start to implement intermittent fasting, have immediate weight loss. They have immediate uh, improvement in their hemoglobin A1C and their other lab values. It's really stunning how much it helps. Now, I'm going to tell you one more at the end, but let me talk first about uh, autophagy. And then I'm going to tell you one that might surprise you. Autophagy is basically your body's ability to use old cells and old tissues and basically reuse them to build new and improve and, and healthy tissues. So if you have, and you've seen people who have lost a ton of weight basically on a starvation diet, on a, on a super high carb whole grain diet where they basically just constrict calories so much their body has no cho choice. They're miserable during that time, but that's possible to lose a lot of weight that way, but it's not a fun way to do it. And one of the main side effects of losing weight that way is that you have no energy and you're, you're chronically tired, chronically 
ill or angry or hangry. And if you lose a lot of weight that way, you tend to have a lot of loose skin or redundant skin. When you are using intermittent fasting, your body is able to eat up that excess skin to make new and improved tissues. I've had multiple patients who have lost substantial amounts of weight with intermittent fasting, and they don't have the redundant loose skin. So if that's been a big concern of yours, if you're overweight and you're like, yeah, but I don't want to have all that skin and have to have surgical procedures to have it removed, intermittent fasting. Trust. Okay. Now, let me tell you about this final benefit that I, I'm, I'm a little surprised at. Uh, because the the human brain is such a magical thing because it's so complicated. You know, some doctors pretend to understand it, but we don't really understand many, many things about the human brain. But I've had multiple people start to implement intermittent fasting in into their lifestyle as a means of weight loss or to help their diabetes. And months later, they come back and they say, you know, I don't have to take my depression medicine anymore. Or they'll say, you know, I used to be so anxious all the time, worried, anxious, upset and that's better now i'm so much calmer and the first few times i heard it you know like a good doctor i'm like "Mm, okay i'll I'll chalk that up but i'm not going to make any decisions based on that but i've heard that 50 70 times five times now from different unique patients coming back and saying yeah i stopped taking that prozac i stopped taking the zoloft i don't need it anymore which makes me very happy. Okay, let me just tell you that that really makes my day when a patient it no longer needs a pill because they fixed their life or they fixed their diet. And I've I've heard that enough times. And then there's also more and more research coming out that shows that intermittent fasting and the ketogenic diet can improve your mood to the point where you don't need your medicine anymore for for depression or anxiety. So if you enjoyed this video and you want to hear more information like this, please take one second and subscribe. I think the little button is right in here somewhere, and there's a little bell beside it. If you click the bell, then every time I get a new bright idea, you'll be one of the very first to know. So this is Dr. Barry. I'll see you next time.